This is the Far East Network, Tokyo. Parents are needed at the Yokosuka Youth Center to assist staff members in chaperoning teen dances and field trips. Interested parents should call the Yokosuka Youth Center at 234-7218. Your number again, 234-7218 for Yokosuka Youth Center. Radio. The time at the tone, 12 midnight. Network News. This is the Far East Network. Ladies and gentlemen, our national anthem. Far East Network now begins another broadcast day. The Far East Network is an affiliate of the Worldwide Armed Forces Radio and Television Service and is authorized to broadcast on the following frequencies. Tokyo, 810 kilohertz, 3.91, 6.155, 11.75, 15.26 megahertz short wave. Misawa, Iwakuni, and Sasebo, 15.75 kilohertz AM. The Far East Network hopes it will be a part of your day today and every day. And good morning. Welcome to East of Midnight for a Saturday. Got a special show coming your way this morning. We're going to feature Pink Floyd from their albums Adam Hart Mother, Metal, Obscured by Clouds, A Dark Side of the Moon. The Piper at the Gates of Dawn. American Top 40. This is Casey Kasem in Hollywood, and we're ready to begin the countdown of the most popular songs in the USA. Kicking things off this week on American Top 40 is Ricky Lee Jones slipping from number 12 to number 40 after a dozen big weeks in the countdown with Chucky's In Love of 10 songs in this week's countdown by female solo singers. Ricky Lee Jones at number 40 falling from 12 with Chucky's In Love. Well, two years ago, Bonnie Pointer left her sisters, the Pointer sisters, to go it alone. This week, she hits the 40 for the first time. American Top 40 once a week with AT40, and you know where your favorite songs are in the national music scene. My name's Casey Kasem, on with a countdown, and the Japanese duo, Pink Lady, at number 38, moving up two with Kiss in the Dark. The Camp Zama and Atsugi Naval Air Facility Credit Unions are hiring new employees. If you would like to make an appointment for an interview at the Camp Zama Credit Union, call 233-4934, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. At Atsugi, call 228-6602 on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You're listening to Radio 810, the Far East Network, Tokyo. Time at the tone, 2 p.m.
Good afternoon. I'm Navy journalist Betty Russell in Tokyo with FEN News. President Carter is on his working vacation on board the Sturm. Jay Giles. Got those freeze frames. We repeat this again just so there's no confusion now. The bus going from Yokota Air Base to Yokosuka Naval Base tomorrow will depart at noon instead of 1.30, of course. So everybody's going to ride the bus back. Be down there about noontime, right? Attachment 17, your first weather wings, is mostly cloudy all day today. And it's uh, supposed to rain around midnight or so, they say. I hope not. Uh, highs for tomorrow will be in the low to mid-60s. The overnight lows for tonight will be near 40. So uh, it looks like it's going to be shaping up for a rather pleasant weekend, temperature-wise, anyway. So uh, tomorrow wouldn't probably be a good idea to make a picnic, but, uh, <clears throat> well, you can have sunshine anywhere you want it, right? Okay. Uh, if you've got one of those little portable lamps, you can drag it around with you. You know, when you arrive at Yokosuka Navy Base, you don't need to feel lost. You can come to the Area Orientation Briefing at the Human Resources Management Detachment. That's a lifesaver, huh? The next brief is going to be given Monday, March the 15th, and you can learn things to do and where to go for help during your first few weeks on the base. Now, for more information or reservations, call us number 234-5886. Again, that's 234-5886. Yeah! It's been a cloudy day, man. The sun's been shining on me. Yes, it has. Must be my sunny disposition. Get out of here. Here's Van Halen. My pretty woman. Look at me. Now. 